This is the solution to written homework 53. Okay, so let's uh, split up the definition into its pieces. Okay, so uh, this one goes with the red. So zero goes there. And one goes there. Okay, two will go with the next one. So then, so then two. Goes here, all the way up to six. So three, four, five, six. And then the rest of them. <clears throat> we'll call the blue definition. Okay. <clears throat> so now let's perform our, our evaluations. So the first one's pretty easy. So the red points are one, so one, one. How about the green points? So half of two is one, and then 1 1.5, two, 2.5, three. <coughs> and then at seven, <coughs> At 7, that would be 2 times 7 minus 9. Ah, this should be, this in fact should be a blue point. That's why I was confused. Okay, so this is a blue point. If I plug in, yeah, that's a blue point. So in fact, that's uh, let's try that again. So two times six uh, minus nine, that's a three. So this is a blue three. Okay, then now plugging in uh, seven. So two times seven minus nine, that'd be five. And then up by two, so seven, nine, 11, 13, 15, 17, 19. Let's verify that last one. So 2 times 14 minus 9, 19. Very good. So let's plot. <coughs> so each grid line is one unit. Okay. So red point. point at 3, so 6, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then up by 2 from now, so at 7 it's 5, and then up. So we made it that far. So now, the joins occur at 2 and 6. So this this is x is 2. That's where one join occurs. And this is x is 6. That's where the other join occurs. 
So that means that in coloring this in, this is the red function, and it goes all the way here. So that's the red. And then the green is this. It goes all the way to there. And then the blue.